So the new Godzilla XCOM trailer, we saw a better look at Scar King, his weapons, and apparently his army. I know for a 100% fact we saw Shimo in that cave, but what about all the other apes that were around? Is that a part of his army too? I mean, we did see some that were beating the ground when he jumped down, you know, looking excited. The video's by Dangerville, and he's hopefully going to explain to us... What's going on? He said Scar King's Titan army that'll kill Godzilla. Do we think so? Do you think he's gonna kill Godzilla? Let me know in the comments. Great ape is set to be the March 29th, brother. Cunning and evil Titan the MonsterVerse has ever seen. He should be the most intelligent. Chimpanzees have bigger brains than gorillas. Easily disarm and overpower Kong. They do. It's a fact. That he will be incredibly physical. There's Shimo. Hold up. At fighting opposing Alpha Titan. Never mind. Didn't see him. Legend has passed down for millennia. He's seen the rise and fall of great civilizations and empires. By the way, is Shimo a boy or a girl? I keep seeing both. both Kongs and Godzilla what is it? Species. What is Shimo? Uh, whispers that the Scar King was the one that started it. Could have been. Could have been. His strength he can use to his advantage, but also his intelligence. Wit. By manipulating there it is. those around him, he's able to stay in charge. That man's with smart. The threat of unimaginable horrors that await you if you disobey his orders. I like the fact with that he's going to be a little he's smarter. Able to enslave a civilization of Titanus Kong, with some that are subservient and some that actively support him. With this, he forms we saw an that. entire city that he uses to do his bidding. Not if all of them are like supporting. You know what I'm saying? doing with the enslaved Kongs, then check out the companion video and what he was doing but there were some that were beating the ground when he jumped at kong so short, he is most likely using the kong them right there resources and those that end up in his good books get higher ranks and rewards which we and he had that you know crew around him up there bowing and some banging the war drums exactly implying that there is a hierarchy in so wait now that i'm thinking about this what would you think if he had an actual army of like the kong species so what if scar king not only has shimo but also a giant kong army to fight kong and godzilla that would make me think a lot different about how this movie's gonna play out. Let me know they in the jump, comments what you think. On their size and personalities, That'd be kind of crazy. Great apes like chimpanzees we saw nothing other than that in the trailer about it. To get oh. ahead. The top dogs of some species, such as spotted hyenas, are determined by sex or lineage. Spotted Much hyenas? As ascend in a monarchy, so it's easy to imagine a primate titan society following and serving the most dominant. And at the top of the chain is Scar. That roar, bro. But if you look Sounds closely, like a savage. He has a small group of Kongs that he sticks close He doesn't. They do look evil. Those look evil for sure. Bodyguards, but the alliance is far deeper than that. We have reason to believe that these are the Scar King's team of Apex Titan killers. His right-hand men that he uses to help keep the apes in line. Similar to the Hand of Atriox from Halo Infinite, where the banished leader had he threw a it back to Halo. of warrior brutes and elites that served their leader, these are the ones that Scar called his closest allies. That makes sense, bro. That makes sense. The most, so what about the, the ones one below? Follow him into battle. Maybe they're just so warriors. Reason, they're his most trusted warriors. the Hand of Scar. Hand of Scar. He killed the largest of Titans. That's sick, they actually. They look down upon the rest as they stand side by side. I wonder how the big they are, too. sits from his golden throne. They would be in charge of watching over the compound, keeping order. That's Planet of the Apes. With an iron fist controlling resources such as food, stemming disputes, and also maintaining a pecking order that determines who gets to mate with whom, keeping the population <laughs> in check. Scar likely showers these titans with riches and luxury. He just controls Large everything, basically. Stock with food, water, and wine. They'd be treated like royalty, like no other great ape under his rule. This isn't unheard of in nature, like in hyenas, hyena bro. groups, where royals at the top get access to more food. Who do you think's gonna win, bro? Godzilla would catch wind and Kong, and would or Scar King and Shimo like and the army? Staying in line and ensuring that the I forgot about the army. Place. For Scar, this is the perfect system, but one that's built on mass oppression and slavery. Something that's actually reflected in some of what we see in humanity. Considering the director stated that the Scar King represents the very worst of humanity. The very it's worst very of easy humanity, to draw bro. The connections. So at the top of the, the chain, worst. alongside Scar, the, the tooth. I don't know why I thought that was a claw. The very first trailer. Through means of fear. 
They are larger and stronger than the rest, which would be necessary as his personal body. That part was so in sick. Case right someone there. like Kong came along. We don't have names for the individual members of the Hand of Scar, but they probably don't even have sure names, bro. It's just thing to one, two, and three. We see them several times throughout the trailer. Monkey one, two, one and three. Attempting to capture Suko, which but is Suko's a sap. Bro, if Suko's Scar defeating these guys, I'm not worried about the army. Scar trusts no offense to Suko, but he's tiny. Compound and bring his son home to him, not out of love, but to keep him working. When a Kong steps out of line, whether that be they stop working or they try to start an uprising, they would be beaten by the three of them, humiliated, and in extreme cases, executed. Dang. This is what we saw in the new Empire trailer. They can be thrown into the pit and fed to the frost. So I think Titan, Kong is stronger, Shimo. but Scar King is going to be smarter, and he's got the group be behind him. As a tactic to silence Ooh, any potential it's going to be good. Revolutions. Going to be good. And in our video on what the Scar King's plans are, we discuss the possibility of Scar using spies to scope out any potential opponents and to keep a close watch it on the sense. Earth and even the surface. He's got a that group. That task may be relegated to one Baba's of the members of the special unit and any information would be returned and relayed to the king as it's from a member that Scar can truly trust. I mean, it in makes sense. In regards to their place in the film, they will likely come to Scar's defense if his life was threatened. So we may see them group together to take down the King of the Monsters and King Kong. They would be well trained in order to properly support the Dang, Scar so Scar King, King would have a group, group of, of apes, gorillas. Formidable opponent, he would have Shimo, Godzilla and Kong, and he'd have his whip tanky. Their lives alongside their leader. But it's just keep get, end, it keeps getting more interesting. Them slaughtered in battle and in the process, those of Kong's species under their oppressive regime are in turn freed leaving kong as their new champion and ruler to hey. lead them and guide them towards a brighter future without the hand of scar that would be sick into the next battle when they so end the movie off with destroyer trailer what we can wouldn't that be sick that this i'm just guessing but become very important they gotta to the end story. it off with something Acting cool spies, like a build-up enforcement overseers bodyguards assistants and also friends to the scar king trusted allies that support i like it die for i like master. the theory bro i but like the theory in the end there'll be no match for our apex titan that's right what no match about the idea of scar having a team of close allies do you think they're making the titans too smart no nah. do you like the idea of intelligent titan groups i mean personally i like the idea that you know scar king could potentially be smarter i mean he's a chimpanzee they are smarter than gorillas and i like the idea of him having an army too because with evolved godzilla well other than shima i don't know let me know your all's theories in the comments and i will see you all tomorrow thank you for watching with me i love ya goodbye